Most people in Kakamega Forest get water from the rivers. This is untreated water. So these people have to boil the water before they consume it. You have mothers and children, usually little girls, who spend long days collecting water and firewood at home. It's a very small community, but there is a lot of poverty. Even if you, you tell them, boil this water, the firewood has to be bought. Life becomes a bit difficult, so they end up drinking dirty water. We have uh, the diarrhea. That's uh, the water-related diseases, plus the general ailments. Today I'm distributing livestock to homesteads and I'm doing 10 homesteads in a day. We have employed 4,000 health workers to go door to door and install a free life straw in every home, benefiting 4.5 million people. The life straw is a point of use water filter. It runs totally off gravity, without chemicals, just with a filtration technology, you can actually achieve EPA standards of water quality in terms of virus or parasites. Just by distributing life straw, we're going to have impact on a number of the Millennium Development Goals because we're targeting diarrhea and pneumonia here, which are two of the three biggest killer diseases among children under five. Secondly, as the population gets healthier, children can go to school, everybody can go to work when they need to. Everybody benefits from this. The cornerstone of the project is around creating behavior change. So if you go door to door, you're really empowering an entire family to take part in the training, to listen to the health education, to have families not just excited, but in tears about how thankful they are. It makes all of the work worth it. I'm healthy. The community to get clean water and to have a community without diseases, free from diseases.